Real women murders, not fiction. Love women, don't kill them. Giving real women, unknown women, recognition to the world. Please support our channel and please, please subscribe. My girlfriend was shot. Your girlfriend was shot? Yes. New Center 7 just got a hold of that 911 call. Investigators said he was the shooter. And that deadly violence was in Urbana. And tonight he is in jail. I'm James Brown. I'm Cheryl McHenry. Now we're learning new details about what led up to that call. New Center 7's Taylor Robertson walks us through the timeline in, that is outlined in court documents. Jamie King was in the Champaign County Municipal Court at 8.30 this morning, and I got a hold of the court records that say he's being charged with both murder and having weapons while under disability. My girlfriend was shot. Your girlfriend was shot? Yes. That was the 911 call King made to Champaign County Dispatch just before police responded to the call at 9.30 Saturday night. King told dispatch his girlfriend, Kaden Harkins, was shot multiple times and was not breathing. Dispatch asked King if he knew how to do CPR. Yes, I know how to do CPR. Okay. But I ran outside. Okay. I ran outside and I don't I can't get back in. She had the keys and everything. According to court records, King then hung up the phone and was not answering any callbacks. Who shot her? She was shot multiple times. Who shot her? When officers got on scene, they asked King where his girlfriend was. King told them he didn't know who shot her and she was still inside of the apartment. Once police got inside, they found Harkins dead in the kitchen. I stopped by where Harkins worked and I talked to one of her clients who told me he had seen King come to visit Harkins at work. Before she uh, was unfortunately murdered, uh, him and her had a serious uh, altercation inside the caring kitchen. They were, uh, he was yelling at her, all sorts of stuff. The cops were actually called over here. Edward said he had just talked to her two days before her death. Uh, I was shocked, you know, to find out that somebody you knew got murdered. It was terrible. He told me Harkins cared about everybody. She was a very sweet, kind, caring person. She uh, tried her best to help you no matter what. Harkins was a case manager here at Caring Kitchen for about three weeks before she died. I talked to some of her co-workers today who described her as a very hard-working and outgoing person. Reporting in Urbana, Taylor Robertson, News Center 7.
Thanks for watching. We appreciate you. Please, please subscribe.